Is that the thing you were talking about? Beautiful, ain't it? It's platinum. Can't see shit out of here. Either way, you owe us. I told you. You'll get paid when we get there. We just walked through hell, man. Uh, what are you, Gents? I don't got it here. Hey, what do you want me to do with this? Oh, I almost forgot. Take off the hood. Well, kid, you're our last loose end. Shame you had to get caught in the middle of all this. Bet you don't even know why you're here. But hey, if it makes you feel any better, it's nothing personal. Just bad luck. Well, we're not going back north. We're lucky to be alive. How else are we supposed to get back, genius? We go east. Take the 95. East. That'll take us days out of our way. Then you could just go back by yourself. Fine. Anything to get you two to shut up. Howdy, partner. Sure is one fine evening, ain't it? Give me your hand, partner. Let's get you out of there. Are you okay, partner? You look like you could use a sarsaparilla. What am I gonna say? No thanks? If you can get these ropes off, I'll do my best to take down my share of the guards. Ring-a-ding-ding, -ding, baby. I've got your back. Another kill to my name. You're a scrapper, baby. They didn't stand a chance. How about me? That's it, baby. Time to vacate these premises. Thanks for getting me out of there. Now, for once, will you just lay down and stay down? No one rules Vegas except me, got it? You're a low-down gopher. You deliver mail. How you like being Mr. Goody Two-Shoes, eh? How's it feeling? Hey! Come on! Hey, look over there. It's those Mojave rats again coming to take our water. You, over there. Go back where you came from, thieves. Don't try our patience. You NCR thugs, this is our land. You won't last here forever. Screw it. Just shoot. They'll get the hint. Hey! Damn rats. Next time I see them, I swear I'll aim right between their eyes. Damn rats. Next time I see them, I swear I'll aim right between their eyes. They've got no right to come near our outposts. This is NCR territory now. One of these days, we're gonna teach them a good lesson. They're hoarding our water. How are we supposed to survive the desert, huh? Well, look who it is. I was just thinking about you. I recently came across a piece of info that you just have to hear. And since you're my best customer, it's on the house. Interested? I don't want to mention it out in plain sight like this. You never know who might be listening. Follow me. Hey. 
Okay, pal. We're gonna do this quick and easy. I know you're loaded down with caps, judging by how much you've already given me. So I thought I'd save us both some time and just take all the caps you have. Hand them over. Wow. I didn't think it would be this easy. I should have done this years ago. Guess I'll be going then. Oh, here's a final tip. Don't ever follow anyone into a dark alley in Freeside. Later, chump. Status. Operational. Loading memory banks. Current designation. Koch. Current mission. Warning. Primary defensive objective. Designation Kaylee. Taken by unknown hostile entities. Initiating full countermeasures. Greetings. I do not believe we have met before. I have the singular distinction of being designated as Boar. My, how rude. If you must know, I am here to assist my master Keeley in her research. Very little, I'm afraid. I've been stuck here calculating protein sequences for most of our sojourn here thus far. Master Keeley has done most of the exploring. She might be able to tell you more. Castle and Hector, huh? Got a thing for little kids? We saw you follow the kid in there. Figured we'd teach you a lesson. Right. No big deal. We're gonna beat the hell out of you now. But don't worry. We don't think it's a big deal either. Howdy. Watch Come, out! What you want, freak show? Who wants to know? You here for my dogs? Can't have my dogs? Here for meat? You can't have my meat! Meat's for dogs! I'm Violet. Dogs are mine, meat is mine! <laughs> Good shit. Psycho, top quality. You want? Might know a guy who knows a guy. <laughs> Good. M more for me. Don't f with fiends. Driver Nephile will brain your skull in. Cook, cook, cook. You don't even know what he'll do. Dogs? Good dogs. My dogs. Fiend dogs. Tear you up. Arf, 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 ah, ah, arf, arf. Arf, arf. <laughs> okay, folks. I called you out here because I've grown to trust you. Prim, the town to the south, is looking for some new law. I know that you guys don't have experience with law enforcement, at least not on the enforcement side. However, I also know that you are honorable and looking for some redemption. This is our chance for redemption. Now let's head down there and bring them some law. Thanks for convincing Myers to come share for us. First time I feel safe in a long time. Hey. Okay, I need some answers now. These guys just barged in here and said they were under orders to keep me here until you arrived. I'm about five seconds away from telling my men to take them down, so speak fast. And I suppose they want me to help see that happen? That seems pretty reasonable. This is bullshit! Why are we even talking about dealing with these guys? Pace, this isn't really a good time to have this discussion. Wrong. This is exactly the right time. I'm about to prevent you from making a huge mistake. Pace, don't do this. I won't stand with you if you do. Then I'll stand on my own, just like I always have. Just like a king should. And you, bringing these assholes in here like you're doing us some kind of favor. You can take your new friends and get the hell out of here, because the answer is no. The Kings will never deal with trash from the NCR. 
Not anymore, it isn't. He's not in his right mind if he's even thinking about making a deal with this scum. Uh, no. We would never survive. We need to stick together. I'll go with whatever the king decides, but I'll be watching these NCR scumbags like a hawk. If they try anything... We'll deal with that should the time come, Pace. Now, I'm sure these gentlemen are as anxious to get out of here as we are to see them go. Hey, pal. I made so much recently that I was able to afford this little number, too. How do I look? You said it. With these threads, people are finally gonna start noticing me. Oh, yeah. I wanted to tell you that I got some new info for you. Each tip's gonna cost a hundred caps now, though. Cause I got plans. Big plans. This is a lesson, Mr. Soren. A lesson in faith. What is this, Miss Van Graaff? I don't understand. Who is this man? What does this have to do with our deal? Everything. Up until recently, this man was an employee of mine. He's quite handsome, don't you think? I know I did. We became close. I warned him that I was a very jealous woman, and he said he understood. Apparently he didn't. Last week, I chanced upon him and Gamora, being serviced by one of their two-cap whores. I was not pleased. I tell you all this because I want you to know that this man means a great deal to me. Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. Okay, everyone. Show's over. Back to work. <laughs> I think he wet himself before he left. That was pretty good making up that part about sleeping with Jacob. You did make that part up, right, Glory? Damn it, girl. What has Mama always said about tipping the help? I thought this was about him stealing money from us. He was stealing money, though he could have kept it for all I cared. God knows he earned it. Something on your mind? Who am I? I'm the scariest motherfucker you ever gonna meet. I'm Cook Cook, bitch. Better not forget it. If I had to guess, it's because I cook shit for the rest of the gang. I'm a good cook. Maybe I'll make you dinner sometime. That's right. Ramen, more rats, lizards, the occasional traveler lost in the wrong part of town. Not Queenie, though. I'd never cook my Queenie. That's Queenie. She's the prettiest Brahmin in the wastelands, aren't you, Queenie? Yes, you are. Who's a good girl? <laughs> yes, you are. Yes, that's right. NCR. Bunch of soft little bitches. They got no stomach for life in the wasteland. Got some choice strains, though. I'll give them that. <laughs> yeah, I'll give him that, all right. Of course I do. You want to meet him, eh? Even money where the Violet's dogs rips you apart, or Nephi caves in your skull with that eye of his.
Hey there. Don't suppose you'd be looking to buy a Brahmin? You look the prospector type. I can see from all the junk you're carrying. You could be moving ten times the haul each salvage trip. You need yourself a genuine pack animal. Lucky for you, I got one. Five hundred caps, even. Smartest decision of your life. You got the wits and the nerve, then Betsy here has a back strong enough to shift a solid ton across the Mojave. Old war tech, guns, water, whatever you're into, she can carry it. You're gonna be rich. Come with me and I'll give you the reins. Hey man, what are you up to? Bye. Hi. Welcome, brother. How can I help you? Well, that's an interesting question. Among the church, I'm called Elder Gunnarsson. The followers call me Doc. You can call me Bert, though. I surely am. Well, sort of. I came out from Utah about six months back, saw a need for my help here. The followers weren't too happy about that, of course. They haven't been too fond of the NCR for a while, but I go where I'm needed. Following a lost cause, I'm afraid. My old friend Nephi fell in with a bad crowd. Drug runners, raiders... Probably worse things it's better not to dwell on. When his gang headed west, I followed. I thought perhaps I could turn him back to the church. I never was able to reach him. He has allowed drugs and hatred to consume him. He runs with the fiends north of here now. They call him Driver Nephi. Who the fuck are you and why are you bothering me? Bert? That scaly, corpse looking f. You tell him I'm never going back to his little cult. And get the fuck away from me before I cave in your skull. Back again? Jesus. Name's Nephi, friend. Driver Nephi. Pleasure to meet you. Now you fucking dolt. Why the hell would it be a pleasure? Fucking ain't right it is. This baby's my life, my love, my strong right arm. Killed a lot of fuckers with this hunk of iron, yes sir. Huh? Oh, lots. More than any other fiend. Hundreds, maybe. Wham, bam. Oh, God, my brains. You hit me in my brains. Easy as that. I could. I'm not terribly inclined to, though. If you go talk to him, they might kill you and rob me of the fun. Get fucked. Hey, I'm sorry about being so dismissive about your suggestion before. I thought a lot about what you said. There have been times when just a little bit of money from a stranger would have made a huge difference to me, so I get where you're coming from. Maybe I could make that kind of difference for someone else. Ah, who am I kidding? You really think so, pal? I'll start looking into it. I bet I can help a lot of people around here. Yes. Oh, hey. Didn't think I'd see you here. I decided to stop scrounging for caps and start making a difference. 
The followers have been really great. There's always something that needs to be done, and everyone here treats me really well. Sorry if you stopped by my old spot looking for info. I've been so busy lately that I haven't heard anything. Anyway, feel free to stay as long as you like. I've got to get back to work. Quit dragging your feet, recruit. Pick it up! How the hell did you make it through boot camp, Private? You run like a feeble old man, Private. That's better, but you're still not winning the battle, boys. No time for idle chatter. These boys need whipping into shape. with security operations. Do not interfere with security operations. You low-down snake. I wish I'd left you in the ground to rot. Draw! Entering combat. We'll still rise again. Your betrayal won't defeat me. This is nothing compared to what's waiting for you up in the penthouse. Engaging. You're actually going to do this all Engaging. over again? Engaging. Unauthorized personnel in Why are you doing area. this? You've come back to kill me this time, I assume. Ironic how this turned out. The thousands of hours I spent calculating odds, running projections, planning for every contingency. Only to be done in by a mail carrier with a grandiosity complex. I... Robert Edwin House, am deceased. Please approach a Securitron and take one of the printed obituaries. No. Continuing patrol. Don't worry, I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you happen by. I want you to witness the fate of Nipson, to memorize every detail, and then... When you move on, well, I'd like you to move west towards the Mojave outpost, to let the profligates there know about the little sermon I prepared for them here. I am Gaben, of Kaisar's Legion. I serve my master as the one of his Frumentari. We Frumentari are soldiers of a different stripe, capable in battle, but skilled as infiltrators and agents as well. The Legion is civilization reborn. Our culture is based on virtues such as martial excellence, loyalty, and justice. But you'll learn all there is to know in due time. Legatus Linnaeus, monster of the East, will soon arrive to command Kaisar's troops in battle. The dam will fall, and the rest of the profligate West will soon follow. What can be said? He's a man of towering intellect. The founder of the Legion, conqueror of 86 tribes. Kaisar is the salvation of mankind, his Legion the rebirth of civilization in a benighted age. Don't worry, you'll know him well when you serve him, or you'll be dead. The New California Republic celebrated its second victory at Hoover Dam, establishing definitive control over the entire Mojave wasteland. Ah, our hero returns. What can I do for you? Surprisingly good. Our forces have managed to secure the region with little resistance, and trade should soon reach an all-time high. The Brass was particularly surprised by the lack of domestic threats in the area. They were prepared to spend months pacifying known troublemakers. 
When they found those threats absent, they turned to the man in charge of the area, but Shu being Shu, he denied having anything to do with it. So now the men have to answer to Brigadier General Moore, and both they and I have you to thank for it. We made a good team. I hope we can work together again in the future. With their leader dead, the rest of their army retreated to the east. We've sent scouts to track them, but that's it. We don't have the forces or supplies necessary to chase them down. More's the pity. Still, I've sent a few skilled men out to make sure their journey is eventful. It should be a long time before they even think of returning. All those NCR troops should see me to celebrate. Come one, come all. And NCR wins. No, really, I'm shocked. I totally didn't expect the guys with advanced armor and seemingly unlimited ammunition to take down an army of machete-wielding ingrates. Welcome to Vegas, capital of the sixth state of the new California Republic. Wow, what are you doing at Helios? I feel like I should salute. The attacks have stopped. Winning the dam saved our asses. I can't believe it's over. I figured the dam would fall and this place would be our last stand. With the Legion defeated, things are great now. Reports indicate that NCR forces emerged victorious and the Legion scattered amidst the defeat of its most feared military leader. Mr. House's Securitron army took control of Hoover Dam and the Strip, pushing both the Legion and the exhausted NCR out of New Vegas. Guess it's true what they say. The House always wins in the end. See? Mr. House has everything well in hand. That old coot house is gonna make me rich. With all the new rules and regulations in New Vegas, I'll make a killing circumventing them. Welcome to New Vegas, where a new day is dawning. As if House didn't have enough control already. At least we don't have to deal with NCR or the Legion now. While it initially appeared to be an NCR victory, we're receiving word that our own Mr. House may have been the one to secure the dam for himself. What's up? For some reason, it warms my heart that we fought for the kooky old geezer. Guess he reminds me of someone. The Brotherhood used the Battle of Hoover Dam as an opportunity to retake Helios I, and came to control the area between it and Hidden Valley. Helios I is safe in our hands, and our hands alone. We will not lose this place again. Under NCR control, this place was a gun in the hands of a child. All that Kaisar promised has come true. You serve the Legion well, Amicus. Awe, Amicus. With Caesar's Legion in control of the dam, I think things are going to get much more difficult around here. Why not just put the slave collars on us yourself, you bastard? With the Legion at the dam, it won't be long before they enslave us all. Preliminary word is that Caesar's Legion has taken control of the dam, and that the NCR presence in Nevada is severely crippled. Our way. Novak will serve as an example after we kill everybody who opposes us. Very well. You've done us a great service. I've provided you the location of a contabernium of eight legionaries. True to Kaiser. Awe, are we ready? True to Kaisar.
like that? Move along. The profligates here were weak. No fight in them. So the cub enters the wolf's den. What do you want, cub? You march all the way out to Red Rock Canyon, enter my home as bold as you please, and you have no idea who I am? Nothing to worry about. If you had hired one of those other hacks, you'd be up to your ass in lowlife right about now. You're imagining things. It's just the rush of adrenaline caused by your near brush with death. Luckily for you, I was here, so there's no reason to get out of sorts. What do you have for me? So that's how it happens. Okay then, I'll have some guys pull him off the street when no one's looking. So you're saying Oris isn't available? That's right, but I'm available, and I'm cheaper. But I always hire Oris. How do I know you're not trying to steal my business from him? Look, the Kings clubbed him from behind and dragged him away. I don't think missing your commission is his number one concern right now. Fine then, I guess I'll hire you. Much obliged. What do you want? Not much to tell. We're a bunch of guys that just want to do our own thing. And anyone who's got a problem with that can shove it. It ain't much to look at, but this dump has something that even the Strip doesn't. And that's absolute freedom. You go other places, and there's always someone screaming at you to act a certain way or to not do certain things. Freeside's not like that. Everyone here is free to do whatever they want. And I, for one, wouldn't want it any other way. What about it? If someone takes your stuff, you're free to take it back. If you can't, maybe you shouldn't have come to Freeside in the first place. We do what we want, just like everybody else. We just have more guys, so other people tend to do what we want, too. If somebody does something we don't like, we let them know about it. If they're strong enough not to care about us liking it, good for them. People can do whatever they want. They just have to keep in mind what'll happen afterward. I guess you could say we don't have law so much as consequences. Aside from this place, there's the Atomic Wrangler just up the street. Women, gambling, booze, you name it. They got you covered. If you're more of a prude, the followers run a mission out of the old Mormon fort up toward the North Gate. Great place if you're hurt, I guess. If you like things dangerous, just past the Wrangler is the Silver Rush, where the Van Graaff family peddles the weapons. Their stuff is outrageously priced, but if you want to shoot something high-tech, that's the best game in town. Yeah? Yeah, I just got word of that. There's a squad of rangers standing by. Sergeant McGee will take over as sheriff, and the rangers will be his deputies. This town will be in NCR territory. This means that aside from protection, the citizens will also need to become registered NCR citizens and pay any appropriate and associated taxes. Roger. I'll radio them over now. Hello? Yes, Lieutenant. Are you ready to depart for Prim? Yes, sir. Okay, we have some soldiers heading to town now. I'll have them sweep the Bison Steve before they start regular patrols. Prim is secure against outside threats. Be interesting to see how long the natives stay grateful. You could do worse than leave your life in my hands, Wanderer. Far worse. A hunter cap sees you safely through Freeside. What do you say? You can go without one. But you'd be up to your waist in vermin either begging for your caps or demanding it at knife point the whole time. I've got a reputation for shooting first and not really bothering to ask questions later. With me around, the vermin should keep their distance. So what'll it be? 
I've already spotted two other potential customers while we've been chatting. Wonderful. One thing up front. The moment you leave Freeside, our contract is done. That being said, please, after you. Peace, Traveler. Just a hunter out here killing things and hoping their hides fetch more than the bullets cost to kill them. Sign says you go south. Just look for the roller coaster. Oh, and don't go north. A caravan just got sacked up the road. It just gets worse the further north you go. Death claws. Death in general. But it's your ass, I suppose. That's a dangerous question. Ask the way a bandit might ask. But since we're close to town, I'll trust your good intentions. I could use some stem packs. How about some nice bloat fly steaks in trade? What'd you think of Mr. House? I was surprised he only had the two robot sex slaves. Why do you scare my cattle? Don't scare the herd. There, in the corral. Yes, the herd. Doggies alone. Doggies. It can't be. How the hell? Got enough? Run! He's got free! Dead claws are loose! Get out of here! I can't believe that the thorns no more. All hell broke loose when the creatures escaped from the thorn. One of those beasts cut my friend in half. How the hell did they escape from Red Lucy? Oh, hi. Thanks again for helping us with that data. I mean, the feed only lasted about 30 seconds, and it's not that useful, but... Well, we tried. After two tries, I think I've learned enough. I'm sure there's something more promising I could be helping the other followers with. Uh, oh yeah. I didn't tell you about the first time. I'd rather not talk about it if you don't mind. True. All right. The first try was a little less professional. Someone important on the Strip had access to some of House's technology. Specifically, a Securitron. And more specifically, the someone was Benny. I know, I know. He shot you in the head and everything. But this was a while ago. I knew he was sleazy, but I didn't realize he was so cold-blooded. 
Ugh, it was so gross. It was bad enough that I didn't get any data out of the Securitron. This is why I didn't want to talk about it. It only happened once. I chalk it up to sleep deprivation and one atomic cocktail too many. That's sweet of you to say, even if it isn't true. Howdy, partner. Let's skedaddle. Got something to show you. It's just at the top of the ridge here. There you have it. New Vegas. Pretty as a diamond flush. Well, Rambler? It's a royal flush that beats all. So let's crown this hand. Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs> Ain't that pretty? Don't take in the view for too long, though. Word is the Legion's on the move. Head on back and see the boss real soon. Here? Evening. Hi, I'm Fretwell. Later. Fretwell again, brah. Later. Freddy of 30. Bye. Yo, I'm Willis. Trooper Willis to you, punk. Bye. Henchman number one, yeah. Later. Henchman number two, bro! Later. Me again, a-hole. Bye. Have you destroyed the Brotherhood of Steel? This is no time to be droll. Oh, by all means, yes. That's refreshing. You might use that against them, or kill them another way. It's up to you. Return when it's done. That would make for a welcome change. I'll expect to see some tangible progress before long, then. I like to think you have enough sense to do the right thing. The rewards for doing so are immense, as are the punishments for not doing so. Well enough. Be on your way. The courier, with the aid of Yes Man, drove both the Legion and the NCR from Hoover Dam, securing New Vegas' independence from both factions. Mr. House, no NCR, no Legion, no rules. New Vegas is gonna be just one wild, never-ending party. An independent Vegas. Never thought I'd see it. House may be gone, but the players remain the same. Business as usual, then. They say you single-handedly assaulted the dam and massacred everyone. That must have been quite a sight. 
But in the shocking turn of events, an army of Securitrons has seized control of the dam, preventing both sides from claiming it. Now, sources of the dam are telling us that the involvement of one key person appears to have heavily influenced the outcome. Oh, you can't miss her. She has short red hair, and she's the most beautiful woman who ever lived. You'd really talk to her for me? You should go talk to Blake or Alice. They handle most of our contact with visitors. I watch all sorts of things with my binoculars. Who wants to know, and why? Nice-looking blonde boy? I always wondered if he was watching me back. What's he like? Really? <laughs> That's so sweet. I'd love to go meet him. Is there any way the boomers would let me visit Nellis? Really? Thank you so much. I'll get going right away. You're a terrible person. I loved her. And you let her run right into our kill zone. Why didn't you stop her? Oh, my sweet, blameless Red. Curse the walls of Nellis. Curse our guns and isolation. Her blood is on our hands. Only if we stop shelling everyone who comes close will some good come from this tragedy. If you'll excuse me. I'm not sure you should be here. When I got this assignment, I was hoping there'd be more gambling. Check your fire! You like that? Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Vicky and Vance Casino and Museum. Just mosey on over to the display case and you'll see it plain as day. Quite a piece of that gun. Mint condition, never fired. Well, look at that. I happened to cross this data file locked away in an isolated subsystem. You best not try any funny business, stranger. One word from me and Vance will plant you in the ground. Why would I deny it? I was the one that hacked that cowboy robot while Vance kept him busy. Ain't the first thing we stole, won't be the last. Bye. Whoa, whoa. Got enough? Howdy, partner. Any luck tracking down Vance's gun? Those thieves had some gall stealing from a museum dedicated to romanticizing a couple of criminals. I'll make sure the gun ends up back on display. I thank you. Prim thanks you. And I do believe Vance would thank you if he could. Happy trails, partner. Welcome to the headquarters of the Sunset Sarsaparilla Company. You appear to require assistance. I'll go find someone. Fiends are bad for business. NCR should do I'm glad they don't just job. let any motherfucker through the gate. Freeside smells like shit. There's some serious shit going on between NCR and the Legion. They better not fuck with our power. Fiends are bad for business. NCR should do their fucking job. Business is good. All the family's got money. Of course, Gamora is where the action is. Hey, you baby. What's the haps? Hey. Hey. Don't be carrying any guns into the casino. How's it hanging? 
Ring-a-ding, baby. You should see this place at night. Has the Brotherhood been destroyed? And you think the value of their attack on Helios, the chaos it will sow behind the profligate's lines is worth letting them live? All right, let it be so. The Brotherhood will have to be dealt with eventually, but for the moment, they live to serve. During the fight for Hoover Dam, the Brotherhood took Helios I, inflicting heavy damage on retreating NCR forces. But it was a Pyrrhic victory. Once the Strip was secured, Caesar's forces overwhelmed and eventually routed the Brotherhood from Helios I and Hidden Valley. Don't walk away. Let me show you the time of your life. I got kicked out of Ultra Lux the other day. Man, that place gives me the fucking freaks. spreading stories about the burned man again. Hey there. Well, howdy. Hey, watch your back! 
There be a pack of old ladies running around here somewhere. Don't let them catch you unawares. Ooh! Is there anything more beautiful than a beautiful, busty Brahmin riding a caravaneer off into the sunset? Oh, wait, I don't think that came out right. There are many good things in life, but peeing is definitely the best. You got any change, ma'am? I've got seven kids to feed. There are many good things in life, but peeing is definitely the best. Hey! Don't poke me! A man is never drunk if he can lie on the floor without holding on. I could have sworn I saw some great cons the other day. Damn, running low on smokes again. Hey. Damn, running low on smokes again. You like that? What's going on, man? Get! Over here! Had enough? Business is good. All the family's got money. Of course, Gamora is where the action is. Gamora is always open for business. <laughs> 